Okay, welcome back. There's my my uh, latest on the uh, Bedini motor here. I've switched to the ceramic magnets, the diametric magnets neodymium. I couldn't get it to work. I've been uh, through uh, um, several 2N3055s, uh, so I'm t I'm just air wiring it right now and uh, making a few changes here but it doesn't look like this one here wants to work either so it's probably me so I'm, I'm not quitting uh, uh, update on the battery here uh, I've eliminated uh, what I felt were the things that were corroding the magnesium which were the alum and uh, uh, so anyways, uh, this one, <laughs> we're not getting very much power out of these now. They're 1.09. I was getting 1.3, uh, 1.34 on the original batteries that lasted two years, but I don't care how long they last like that when the corrosion happens the way that they do. Uh, so I've turned around now and uh, um, making a second coil. And this this coil here has doesn't have that plastic in it, so that's just a uh, uh, a magnetite rod in there, uh, mixed with a little bit of rubber, but just enough to to set it up. And this is uh, so far now this this is 15 layers, better than 50 uh, turns per layer. So I. Uh, Still have three layers to go on this one here, but as you can see, coils, uh, the windings are still very tight. It's been very tedious. This is uh, my second complete day on it, so uh, it takes me three days to wind one of these. Okay, anyways, I'm going to get back to work. I'll try and keep you posted on what's going on here, but uh, you know I'm not going to give up. So, uh, later. Peace.